Hello and welcome to Talk Chasers. Today is the next instalment of Project, Project Six. Myself and Nick from Track Tech are going to be transforming this baby into an absolute weapon of a car. Basically, I got bored with the stock Seat Ibiza 1.4 hundred brake horsepower, so I decided to firstly wrap the bumper. I then also had the windows tinted, which was the first episode of Hashtag Project Seat. Today we are filming the next instalments, firstly the springs and spaces, and secondly the exhaust. So I'm really excited for this transformation. I have filmed a before and after sound clip. Please insert that here, future Patrick. <laughs> And that's what it sounds like. It's nothing special, but I really hope the stupid exhaust that I bought for £40 off eBay Universal back box is going to work. Now we do have to do some modification to it. I'm super excited. I'm going to take you along with me. You'll have to excuse the sunglasses, but it's really bright in England and I don't know really, really why. So make sure you give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, hashtag Project C in all your photos, tag me, just do the thing if you have a set of Ibiza for a joke and boy, let's go. Before we get into this video, make sure you go give Nick at Track Tech a follow. His Instagram link will be in the description. Also, note to self, note for you guys, this is not anything that he would do normally. I've asked him to do this, especially for me. This is a project car. I really don't advise you doing anything in the video. It was really quick. He had other work to do, and I said, please, 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 and he did it. So, this is on the limb, don't do this at home, this is not how Nick works, he's a brilliant, brilliant technician and mechanic, so go show him some love on Instagram, don't do this at home, enjoy. <laughs> So the first job was to take off the shocks to get out the rear springs. So in here you can see there was a bolt going through there to connect these two. That comes off and this lowers and you can get your spring out. You can do exactly the same on the other side. Bolt out of here, spring out. I didn't record it because I was doing it. Nick is in a meeting. So the springs we're going to be installing today are a Dorenza Street Track Spring. Basically, I bought them about two years ago when I first got the Seat and never fitted them. So yeah, this is what they are. Yeah, they're nice and red. They're very small, aren't they? They're tiny, aren't they? Yes, lubrication for the nation. So the race springs are on, and we're about to do the front ones. And whilst we're doing the front ones, I can show you my induction kit. Yes, look at it. Yes, many horsepowers from there. Yes. Another message for you, I know it's supposed to be a cold air induction kit, I don't care, I literally just bodged it, cut it, stack it on, I don't really care. It's a funny joke, I mean look at it, it's a Seat Ibiza, so... So the front, right, front left sorry, spring is now on, we're just going to do the other one. I won't show you that because it's the same process as that one. Take the spring off, compress it, and then switch the bits back over. And then put the wheels back on, drop it, and then we might do the exhaust. So the springs are now on, and we're moving on to the exhaust. Now, lesson learned, don't buy anything universal from eBay, ever. Lesson learned, I've done it. We're gonna do it now, we're gonna fix it, but always buy the proper parts, because we're welding things. Yes. This is an exhaust. Cutter thing. Yes. It creates a nice thing. Cut in tight to reach spaces. Oh, look at that spring there. Nice. Loves it. Now I've got your finger of a gun for a nut. Find out. Yes, nice. 
see you later. Right, that's it. Let's run with that. You've got yourself something funky. At this point, I should say, I don't recommend this to anyone, but because it's a hashtag project C, we're going to do it. It's going to be funny. So let's just say, this little part here, because it's ridged, we're going to cut here, and then that can sit over that bit just there. Nice rifling. Nice. Excited. Basically, we've now welded on all the bits we needed to inside, and we're about to put a hanger just on the top of the exhaust so it doesn't rattle about. Uh, and then we shall potentially do a first start. I've got to torque up the wheels after we put it on the floor. So torque those up, make them sure they're nice and tight, and then we shall do a start up and a walk around with the car afterwards. I'm so excited. Well, yet again, reiterate, don't do this at home, kids. This is a project car. You have to remember, it's a project. Yes, it's road legal, but it is a project that's for fun. It's a piss take. It's hashtag Is it lower? I can't. We're not bothered about sound, I can't actually tell. Wow. Bouncy? It looks lower. That's really bouncy. Do you want to do that on the front as well? That has, isn't it? Oh! Oh! Is that, is that supposed to do that? <laughs> I can't tell if it's lower. I think it is lower, but I don't... I don't know! So I suppose the next thing is to start it up. With the exhaust. Are you starting or are you filming? I shall start and film. Silence in the auditorium. Exhaust. Yes, that sounds sick. Is it blowing? Nick, you have done a wonderful job here, my friend. Nikolai! I am so bloody chuffed. And it looks sick! <laughs> Well, that's insane. I'm gonna go to the corner. I didn't do spaces, but I will be getting spaces. But I've got 30 mil drop on the Dorenda Springs, a stupidly loud exhaust, and I absolutely love it. I'm absolutely chuffed. The drop on it just looks so good. And I think with the spaces, it's gonna look even better as well. So I'm super, super chuffed. Well, there you have it. 140 pounds down the drain, and you've got the hashtag Project Seat. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. That's a that that's a good fitment. Right there, that's a good fitment. <laughs>